Lawley. Long ball, which Wilkes will get under, but only heads it in field. Nice ball forward from Yuri and hits Smith with the finish. And Birmingham have a 1 0 lead. 20 minutes on the clock. And you have to say, on the balance of the pressure, it had probably been coming. And in the end, it's Libby Smith, England Youth International, who gets the goal. It's a lovely bit of football. The pass here from Yuri slid delightfully into the path of Smith, who clips it past Kirsty Lavelle. And we're 20 minutes on the clock. Well, Burnley are now chasing the game. And that's why their team have won a corner. Jemaya will take. In towards the near post and it's cleared by Yuri. McPartland nods it back to Elford. Elford squeezing the pass to Ravening. And what a tackle that is. It just opened up for Millie Ravening there for a split second. Huge opportunity. Lovely stab pass there. Wilkes back to Millie Ravening. She's getting closed down by Moore. And then... Lawley just nudges through Amaya and suddenly defence has turned into attack for Birmingham as Moore offloads to Smith, the goal scorer. Smith crosses to Moore, good touch for Moore and then lifting over the bar. Heron passed Ravening and Hamer before passing it straight to Hartley. And that's a handy ball for Laura Elford to chase onto and Laura Elford's through one-on-one -on -one here. It's Laura Elford, can she score? Elford! Into the post, it comes back to her. Keeper's out of play, gets it to Coleman Evans. And scrambled away. Oh, she came mightily close. The width of the post away from extending that. It's just a long ball, isn't it, from Georgia Marshall. Takes out the defence completely. The goalkeeper's backpedalling. Maybe she could have had the shot there. Went round the keeper and that made the angle tight. Hamer, Reedford. Reedford. Ball forward towards Priestley. Priestley's going to get on the end of this. It's Evie Priestley. Round the keeper. It's going to be a penalty. Surely it is. It's a penalty to Burnley in the closing moments. Evie Priestley ran onto it. She didn't get a clean touch on it, but she got enough to get it past the keeper who bundled the striker over. And Burnley, with three and a half minutes left of injury time, I've got a chance to level this match. Would you believe it? Who's going to take it? That's the big question. Millie Ravening would be, you'd think, near the top of the list. She's standing outside the area at the moment. She's now making her way towards the D as we watch the replay. Lucy Thomas stands on her line. Millie Ravening takes a few steps back. Millie Ravening scores, sends the keeper the wrong way and with 90 seconds to go it's Burnley 1, Birmingham 1 and Millie Ravening went straight to celebrate in front of Mason, the Birmingham left back there who'd been trying to put her off before she took the penalty she wasn't put off whatsoever and Millie Ravening adds another goal to her tally for another remarkable season. Not able to do that either. Here's more. Yuri. Yuri going with a left foot cross this time, and again it's saved by Kirsty Lavelle. Thumping shot from Mason. Not the first time that the left back has had a dig. And not the first time that Kirsty Lavelle has made a save this afternoon. She has certainly proved her worth. Yuri with a good pullback, Mason. Now it's with Quinn. Allowed the space to cross, and it's a good cross to Yuri. It's hit the bar. Will they get the rebound home? Lavelle can't claw it away. And Burnley, once again, will have to come from a goal down. They allowed too much space for the cross from the left for Quinn. And after the header hit the bar, substitute Walker was there. So proud into the empty net. 
It's a good header. And Walker responded quick enough. Despite there being three Burnley defenders in close quarters. She got there first and she was even allowed two touches. Wilk sends it back forward. It's a big ball forward. The keeper comes for it. She's gone to ground. Hamer will send it forward and it's scrambled clear. And now Kirsty Lavelle has got to backpedal into her own goal, but Tilly Wilkes is there to make a tackle. But Walker goes forward, and Walker has made the pass to Cho, and Cho will have the shot to the empty net, and Cho puts it wide. Well, Birmingham should have put the game to bed there. There's still two minutes to go. Somehow Cho, she could have walked it in. She just needed to walk the ball forwards after Walker played it into her path. But she went for the first time shot and she bobbles it wide. Hartley, they just can't get it out. They're boxed in. Mason. Mason now for Moore. Moore will shoot. And finally, Birmingham put the game to bed. And Burnley have put everything into this game. But Birmingham have finally put the game to bed and it's Jade Moore the England international an FA Cup winner with Birmingham in 2012 who finally opens up a two goal advantage for Birmingham that will surely see them home